Come on. Oh, it's nearly there. Yeah, there we go. So I've learned rock napping. Well, hello, Shirley Rocks here. So we're looking at Sapiens again. I'd uh, originally checked out the demo for this. This has now entered early access, so I thought we'd check it out again. There's uh, this, the, the development of this um, title is going to split into three stages. So first phase is going to be content. Second phase, multiplayer. And third phase is VR and uh, different types of uh, mobs, apparently. So... Phase one content is going to be, it says it's going to be weaving of linen from twine for bandaging and clothing. Uh, clothing will degrade over time. Hyperthermia traits, starvation and disease as well. Options for helping sick and injured sapiens. Uh, events which create challenges in later game. Uh, resources will rot faster in hotter temperatures. There's going to be more building components, especially roof parts. There's an oven so you can cook food in that or bake bread. Uh, idle sapiens will watch and learn while lovers work. That sounds a pretty interesting twist. Uh, it's going to be Steam achievements and controller support. So, yeah, this this came out into early access the other day, so I thought we'd uh, check it out again. So let's do a new world. I think I will just do random name. Let's see. Let's do a name till I till I like it. It looks like it's in sort of primitive. Uh, language or something okay let's go for mama suli <laughs> mama suli and we're going for everything on um medium so let's create the world and try and pick a place that doesn't uh give me a terrible start to the game so when i first played this i spawned in a really terrible world so hopefully we're gonna okay there's a lot of ice so for millennia sapiens have been exploring mama suli Small tribes are scattered wide across the world, travelling, gathering, hunting and surviving. These sapiens are happy, but they are limited by their lack of knowledge and ambition. Alone they may survive, but can never reach their full potential. You are to become the guardian of this tribe and give them direction and purpose. Your goal is to encourage them to learn, advance and grow, and ultimately create a thriving civilization. Those you choose to lead will be the ancestors of the entire human species, so choose your tribe wisely. Okay, so... First of all... I'm not spawning up there because that looks like snow. So, no to snow. So, we're, <laughs> we're going to spawn somewhere a little bit nicer. So, I'm looking for. So, what I'm looking for is water and greenery. Because I reckon a coastal place like this. So, more like this. So, I want to be nearest water. Now, is this fresh water? It looks like a giant lake. So, let's have a little look at this. This will be alright, I reckon. Going to start off with three people. <laughs> We've got a strong child. We've got a small eating, tone-deaf uh, adult. And does that mean tone-deaf as in they can't hear at all? Um, what negative trait does that actually have, though, as well as having, like, a strong child? Anyway, I'm having this tribe. Right, so here we go. So from what I remember, we have to tell them to collect resources and stuff at the start. Okay. Um, okay, here we are. So first of all, we need to gather hay. So we need to sleep on hay. So we need to collect some grass and dry it out. So move around the world, Wasada. We can uh, order my tribe to clear some grass. So click on a grassy field and select clear. So we, we need to clear five bits of area and it's a cell area so we need to find grassy areas i think these are classed as grassy though so i can click that click clear and just do it like this so it's hexagon based squares so that should be five now so all the uh, strong child and the rest of them are doing the job there we go <laughs> oh strong child Okay, so uh, we can support, we can pause the game with space and we can fast forward with tab. There we go. Can I switch off? No, no, pause. Right, so we've got five grass now. Now what? I think we need to build storage and stuff. Yeah, so to storage your, to store your items, you need to do little resource areas. So each storage area only stores a single type of resource. So... We need to build a six storage areas. Okay, we'll so if I click that. Oh, do I just go in? 
Oh, I need to I need to press E afterwards. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try and build six of these. Should we build these on the bits where we've cleared all the grass, maybe? I'm gonna do it like that. There you go, that's six areas. Okay, so we've stored a little bit of the grass there. Nice. Um I need to store dry hay north of eight. Does that mean does that mean I need more hay then? Okay, let's uh no no no. How do I no how do I how do I cancel? Selecting multiple things. You can select multiple things or build terrain at once and then issue or cancel orders. This is particularly useful for clearing large areas. Okay. I want to cancel this though, because I've done that and I don't want it. And that. And that. Yeah, do not want that. So, issue an order for four more things at once. So, click an object on the ground and hit click select more. So, that's this one. Okay, let's do... 17 rich soil let's select and do clear there we go so i've got 17 bits of dry dry grass that is so much look how they look look, look how you collect in the air the hay just like tiger tiger strike right so we needed eight i think we only had about six or something there so we probably just need to store more of it or, wait a minute, if we click on this, can we give information about this? 16 wet hay, dry soon outside. Okay, so it's just basically this needs to dry. That's all there is to it. And it's probably because of the weather as well. Weather at the top left, you can see, is actually hot at the moment, so that should dry fairly soon. So nice. I've got 22 now in the pile. So... It's incrementing now, look, I've got uh, four dry hay. Also, we need branches as well, so how do I get branches? We need to find branches. Branches are just on the ground, like here, I think. Ooh, that looks like bamboo rather than a branch. That looks like a branch, though. Should we investigate that, see what it is? Okay, so I'll send you off there. There's rocks over there. Um, so we do need a, a tool for that. Right, store. Okay, so we're storing that. Ah, okay, so you do store it by clicking on it. How many do I need to store? Eight of these I need to store. So let's do multiple select. And can I alter the radius? Okay, there's only, there's only two there to collect, but we'll try and store those two. Does bamboo count as a, a branch? I do not know, but we're going to store it. Okay. Hold down shift, you can zoom as well to an area. Right, so branches is the next thing we need. So how, how are we doing with this now? We've got 36 hay. We're still mining all this area as well. There's only two bits left, though. We could just press tab and speed this up a little bit. There we go. Go on, get all that hay. Right, so, so we've got one branch. Well, we've got two branches stored. I need to find more branches. Um, any branches over here? I did tell this one to investigate as well. So he's, he's studying. I think he's studying the effect of branch. Store that one. Hopefully someone's going to get that. Strong kid. Is that strong? No, strong. What's the strong kid doing? Just sitting there. <laughs> sitting there doing nothing. So I don't think we can... We can't just bash the trees down yet. Gather bamboo seeds. Gather bamboo. Okay, we'll try that. We'll click gather bamboo. Maybe that's the same as just gathering um, a branch. We'll see. Right, let's watch the strong kid do this. There we go. Whoa! He's just he's just piling all this up. Look. There you go. Oh, we're well gonna get enough bamboo from this. Look. 
I really wanted to see a look, strong kid. Strong kid can press that. Right, we've got five. Five of eight, seven of eight. We need one more. Um, let's go and gather some more then. Ooh, breakthrough's nearly complete. Um, I want to gather more bamboo. I don't know how much I need, but bamboo seems to be pretty important. So let's gather two plants of that. Let them gather that. So I need one more branch. Close to breakthrough. Let's go and check this out. Okay, nice. Cool has learned the uh, fire lighting skill. So this is what he's been doing over here. Look, he's been, he's been playing with the branch and discovered he can set fire to it. I'm going to store it anyway. I think we can do the same rocks as well. We can do, um, we can investigate them and also store them. So I'm going to investigate one more. Nice. Right, so I've got enough branches now. And then it'll take me to the next little tutorial bit in a second. So you're going to go and investigate that, I think. So the, the, the controls on this are all right. That um, You can zoom in and out. You can um, speed up the way you move around. So it's quite... The only thing I don't know how to do yet is to... If there's like a press H for home to zoom back to your camp. So your tribe has discovered the heat is generated from friction when you rub two sticks together. If it gets hot enough, an ember can produce to start a fire, providing warmth and light. Okay, so we've unlocked a campfire and torch now. And... They'll be happy if they sleep on a bed rather than the hard ground. So now we have enough hay stored. Let's build some beds. Okay, so we need to build me some beds. So we should have the recipe for this now. Hay bed requires three hay. So let me build some beds. Um, we can rotate these as well, I think. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Before you go and do that, pause that, pause that. That's no, 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 no. Cancel that. Can I cancel that? Yeah, stop clearing. Right, so I want to build beds. There's got to be a way of rotating it. Maybe I've read the instructions, bottom left. Okay, so we can rotate it 90 degrees. X, Y, and Z. So, um... Okay, so if I just keep pressing Y. Okay, so that's going to be my storage there. So let's just do the beds over here. And we want to do three of these beds. That's not snapping to. I'd like that to be a bit more snap to grid lines. Okay, we're going to unpause it. Press escape to cancel building something. Right, so each of them needs hay. I don't know how much hay I've actually got. So we've got 39, 36 hay. Oh, it rots in a few days outside as well. That's not good. Anyway, we're going to make our beds. Hopefully I've got enough hay to do this. I think one bed is three hay, and I've got like 39 hay, so we're sorted for that. So they're building up layer by layer, look, that's pretty cool. Come on, strong child. Strong child is the first to complete the bed. Okay, strong child is building what the next that? bed now. What are you doing? Okay, you're using the bed or... Were you using the bed or... Okay, the beds aren't finished then. Oh, we need to build four beds anyway. What am I what am what am I talking about? I've only done three. There you go. I need four for some reason. There's only three of us, but we need to do four beds. Okay, tutorial. Investigate and advance. In order to advance, you need to investigate the world around them. This leads to breakthroughs, like we did with the fire. So we need to investigate all of these things. Now, we've not investigated hay yet, so we'll add that to the, the list. We're currently investigating rock over there. Uh, we need four beds to be finished, which we're doing. I think that one's finished. You're just chilling. So we've just got the last bed to finish. Then someone's going to do that. Currently, we are banging <laughs> a rock against another rock. There we go. We're doing science, look. Ooh, bang rock on other rock. Ooh, rock makes spark, rock goes sharp. Or something like that. So then we've just got the hay to investigate now. Um, okay, now we're up to the next tutorial, lighting a fire. 
Fire is an important discovery which provides light at night, helps to keep your tribe warm and is, when it's cold, allows cooking. So we're going to try and get a campfire going. Um, so where's this? Campfire. We do need six large rocks. So I'm going to build it away from... We'll do it nearish the beds, but not right next to it. But we need rocks for this. So I'm going to click this. Click select more. And then we'll alter, we'll alter the radius as well. So I need, I need six rocks. So we'll drag that until we've got six. Click select and click store and that should be rocks getting collected it's nice that you can see the difference between the dry and the wet hay on there as well which is pretty cool okay we're about to get a breakthrough over here i think bashing rocks is about to uh, pay off so let's see come on come on you can do it i think this gives me gives me like stone hatchet uh knives that sort of technology Come on, you can do it. I know you can do it. I wonder if the science is predetermined for how long it takes, or is it different per character? Okay, that's nearly done. Come on. Oh, it's nearly there. There, there we go. So I've learned rock napping. So, by using one rock to hit another, your tribe will discover the edges can be sharpened. So now we have unlocked stone spearhead, stone hand axe, stone pickaxe head, small rock, and stone knife. Nice. I'm going to click that and grab that. I can grab that on the way back. So we should have um, more stuff we can make soon. I think you're investigating the bamboo, aren't you? We're meant to be investigating the hay, though, aren't we? Wait a minute. How do I investigate the hay then? That is the hay. See, that's bamboo. I think that's the wrong thing. I'm tempted to um, leave them to carry on with this. Unless hay is in the field. Let's have a little look. What's this? Is this hay, do you reckon? It's either hay or a fern. Um, let me have a little look. See if I can spot any hay. I mean, this is going to be like stuff like wheat and stuff, isn't it? It might not necessarily be hay. I think hay is just... Because this is hay, what we've grabbed here, you see. Hay outside. I can't invest... Oh, okay. Oh, stop investigating elsewhere. So we are actually researching it. But I think what we're doing is we've got two pieces of bamboo and some hay and we're trying to think, how does this work with this? Sinasona, a la sona. Oh, he's taking over... The science expert's taking over. Here we go. Hmm. If I put this hay and this bamboo together, we could make a bunk bed. I actually can't remember what I actually make. I think this is the basics for the building blocks for uh, building the buildings. I think it's thatched roofs. Right, what are you doing over here? You're all just chilling. Um, that doesn't look like six rocks. That looks very much like... Oh, it is six rocks. Okay, I'll let you off. Right, we still, still says no one's building it. You, build. Not assigned to firelighting role. Oh, okay. It's probably this one here. He's probably got firelighting because he, he discovered it. Well, anyway, he's about to discover how to build, so we'll watch him. Here we go. Come on, I could just speed it up. There we go. We discovered thatch building. Right. Hopefully he's going to build the fire now. And we've unlocked fat building skill, which is, what does this give me? So, uh, when dried veg vegetation is lined up and placed over a supporting shelter, it can provide watertight shelter. So we can do a roof, we can do walls, we can do more walls. Okay, so we need to, I reckon we need to start gathering more stuff. So let me come out of this. So when a sapien discovers a technology, they become skilled in it and will automatically be assigned a role, allowing them to complete tasks related to that skill. Uh, you should assign roles to them manually too. This will help keep everyone busy. Right, let's pause it then. So if I press Q, bring up the tribe menu, I can assign people stuff. So do I just assign it by clicking stuff off? So you can see, cool, he discovered fire, so he can do fire. 
Ooh. What happens if I, like, say, bring this up and then click on, say, Strong Child and say Fire Lighting? Okay, so he, he can do Fire Lighting. You can teach him the role, maybe. Okay. That's going to be interesting. So multiple people doing multiple roles is probably what I need to do. So we can now have the ability to make tools. So we can build axes and knives and stuff. But I'm going to uh, go, nope, that's it for now. So we are going to uh, pause that for now because uh don't want to do too long chunks in this. Last time I played this, I think I did for half an hour, which I think is a little bit too long. But if you're if you're happy with longer videos, comment and let me know. Let me know what ideal length you'd like to see in this because I'd like to progress with this and see how far we can get with this tribe. So next episode, we're going to find light the fire and we are going to build some crafting areas and make us some funky little hand axes and some stone knives. So that is it for now. This is Sapiens. I'm Shirley Rocks. See you next time.